Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be the October favorites and there's going to be some Halloween favorites thrown in there with it. So if you guys want to see what those are, keep on watching. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and become a member of my YouTube family. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. So let's jump right on in and get started. So let's jump right on in head first with these favorites. Um, the first thing, let me just talk about this nail polish. So this is the Sinful Color nail polish and it is in the shade Bite Me. It is a Halloween color. Um, if you can't find this in the regular nail polish section, I found it in the Halloween section. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to be in there, but it was. So this is what it looks like in the bottle. And I have it on my nails right now. That's what it looks like. Excuse the not great manicure, but that's what it looks like. Um, but I'm going to tell you, I love this color. Absolutely love it. This is what it looks like like that. I don't know if you can see it on the casing inside on the bottle. If you put this on by itself, it's going to be very sheer and just give you this little speckled. I put this on first. It is the Essie's Merino Cool, something like that. I don't know if you can see it. Um, I put this on first, and then I put two coats of this over top of it after it dried. Um, having that color backdrop makes the color pop a lot more. So if you want to get that, I highly recommend doing a base coat first because uh, other than that, it's going to be a very um, transparent reddish copper color but this is this is again what it looks like and it is called bite me I'm obsessed with this this month um, I like it a lot the next one there's not a whole lot this this month um, I haven't got to play with a whole lot of new products but a, some of these are more Halloween geared because um, I've been doing a lot of Halloween makeup looks I know I haven't done any on here which I'm very mad at myself for, but um, this guy. It is the Wet n Wild H2O Proof Liquid Eyeliner. This stuff works really well, like if you're wanting to do um, precise lines for a makeup look or just for your makeup. I mean, it's, it's very precise, it's very pigmented, it is indeed waterproof. Um, this would work really well if you want to be a deer to make that line down your mouth like right there to you know connect your little nose it'd be great for drawing on your nose as well um, I can't remember how much this was but it is again the wet n wild h2o waterproof liquid eyeliner and this is in the shade ultra black if you can see it so that's number two I don't know why I'm so hyper today um Next one. I'm going through these really fast. I don't know why, but that's what we're doing today. Um, it is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Catsuit Lipstick. And it is in the shade Widow's Peak. It is black. You guys, this is a very pigmented black. Let me see if I can get it. I mean, that's one swipe. I'm going to go all over the place with that today, clearly. Let me see if I can get it good for you on there. I mean, this stuff is fantastic. Um, and it's just like the other cat suits. Um, it does dry down matte. And it's not going to go anywhere. So, along with the deer theme, I don't know. Um, you can do that for your top lip and just let it dry really well before you close your mouth or you're going to have transfer. But let it dry to where you can touch it and it's not going to come off on your finger. And the, I mean, this is perfect for it. I think this is like $4.99 at Walgreens, I think. I think it's $4.99. Um, it's the same price as all the other ones are. So, excuse me. This is another favorite. It is not just a Halloween favorite or an October favorite. It's an all-time favorite. It's the NOS Energy Drink. Not sponsored. Anyway. <laughs> um, the next one is this fake blood. 
you guys, this is awesome stuff. It is the Red Spray Blood. This is what it looks like. Um, we purchased this, I think, at Halloween City. I'm sure you can get it at other places. I think this was like $7.99. I've already been playing with it. It looked like I murdered somebody in my trash can the other day because I was squirting it in the trash can. So I'm going to squirt some on my arm over my trash can so you guys can some on my arm. And that's what it looks like. Very realistic. Um, it does run somewhat. And that's how it comes out in the spray. Um, I was a little shocked when it came out because I was expecting like a, a mist. And it comes out like this. But you can see it running. And it does look quite real. Which um, some flake some flake bloods. Some fake bloods don't. But you can see how it's running. And let me see if I can find something to wipe it off. Real quick. Let me grab these Mickey Roadster Racers tissues before this stuff runs. Oh, it's running. It's running everywhere. Oh. Um, but this does, it does stain your arm. Which is kind of cool. Like if you want to, um, you know, make it look like, I don't know, it's like old blood or dried blood. Uh, but it does come off with soap and water, which is fantastic. And I threw it away and didn't wipe off the bottle. Um, and this also, I'll show you. If you don't want to use the squirt and like pour it or, excuse me, something like that, this does screw off and you have the little thing, you know. So, I mean, you can even, let's see. Like make like little drops or you know whatever you're wanting to do um it's kind of like it's kind of like a gel inside but it's not well you saw it when i squirted it out um oh i'm getting this blood everywhere okay the last thing sorry i'm all over the place today i don't know why <coughs> the last thing is this stuff right here it is the neutrogena makeup remover cleansing towelettes I recently got this and I did a video on them. Um, if you missed it, I'll link it up here. But I forgot how much I liked them. Um, and doing all this different makeup stuff and some of the things just don't come off. And like you have to kind of scrub them off if you're using soap and water or even like a just a cleanser. Um, this stuff takes everything off. I mean... Like one wipe and it's taken stuff off and this stuff up here yes it is uh, waterproof if you just you, I mean you're gonna have to scrub any kind of waterproof but if you just work it back and forth it will take it right off so um, I highly recommend that um, I think it's how much are these things They're like four or five bucks but a lot of times there's sales where you can buy one get one half off or something like that um, the places that have sales on them are normally Walgreens, um, maybe CVS does. I don't really go there a whole lot, but, um, I know Meyer and Walmart, some, they have them packaged in a set for like eight or $10, something like that. Um, if you wear a lot of waterproof makeup or you just need something to get your makeup off your face at the end of the day, <laughs> this is a great product to use. I mean, it's really great. Um, I do recommend that if you do purchase these, um, to wash your face after you've used them. Because they do leave um, a little bit of a greasy feel after after you take it off. Like, it leaves it behind. So, I would definitely wash your face afterwards. Uh, if you don't have sensitive skin, don't worry about it. I didn't wash my face the other day, and I got a breakout. Lovely, right? I'm old enough. I shouldn't be getting breakouts. But <laughs> um, that's it for this one. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button before you leave. So I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.